information about a LaSalle University student accused of running a scam to steal close to a million dollars. Police say this may not have even been the first time she's done it. WBZ's Christina Hager is live tonight in Newton where the suspect went to college. And Christina, Ariel Foster did appear in court today, correct? Yes, and court papers are now showing she was also being investigated on completely separate but similar cases of possible fraud here at LaSalle University. This is her dorm where police arrested her and she was arraigned in court today. Ms. Foster, good morning. Walking into court, accused of stealing as much as a million dollars. A far cry from track star Ariel Foster's reputation at LaSalle University. She won a couple awards for the school. She broke a few records. Now the 19-year-old faces a judge accused of faking transactions at her part-time job at LaVisa Jewelry Store in the Burlington Mall. An item was scanned onto the register and the item price was altered to heighten the loss. Um, the item would then be refunded onto a credit card. A card tracing back to Foster, police say. And some of the ways they say she spent the money, a Louis Vuitton bag, plane tickets, a trip to Hawaii, and a Tesla. Is it surprising to think a student would be able to afford those things? Yeah, I mean, there's got to be something up. Court documents show how investigators connected dates and locations with posts on her Instagram accounts. My biggest flex is being able to buy my own Tesla full out under 20 years. And under a photo of a tropical scene, Maui is where I will retire. According to court documents, LaSalle campus police said Foster had also been the subject of multiple investigations for similar issues in the last year in regards to using fraudulent credit cards to pay for tuition. Police searched her Dorchester home where neighbors say they saw the Tesla parked. They also searched her college dorm. Just the fact that like a college student buying a Tesla, like fully buying a Tesla, it's a little suspicious. The police report says Foster eventually said she would take the blame saying, I'm sorry for what I did. She is now out on a thousand dollars bail. Live in Newton, Christina Hager, WBZ News. Christina, thank you.